Okay, well, thanks for those races from Punchestown, Martin. I'm here now at Fairy House, and I'm going to start with the Royal Bond Novice Hurdle, which is a group one, which is number one is Albert's Eyes for Moilet Surfer, two, the Irish King for Joshua Sutherland, the favourite, three, Heart Moon for Leon Van Rensburg, four, Ancient Hill Jim Murray, five, Van Starters for Derek Hinton, six, Frosty Flame for Thunderspark, and seven, Fired Earth for Dee Thompson. So only seven of them here, these novices, under this grade one. They're away. And they're straight into the first hurdle. Everybody's over it, although Heart Moon, the grey at the rear, was very slow and got himself almost detached, but uh, Jockey pushing him along to get back into the pack. So the next one that's going to lead us is Ancient Hill. And we're going to be going past the grandstand. Okay, the second. Everybody's over it. That'll be the last next time round. And that's a fairly short run in, run in here at Fairy House. Oh. Like you dropped your camera there, cameraman. So, Ancient Hill for Jim Murray that leads us by about three to four lengths to Van Starters of Del Hinton. Then we've got the favourite, the Irish King for Joshua. The inside of that is Frosty Flame. Against the fences, Fired Earth. And Albert's eyes out wide with Heart Moon the Grey. Who's just getting himself all over the place. He's got himself blocked in now. He jumped that well, that last. Fence uh, hurdle, but he's uh, really got nowhere to go. No way, the jockey having to take a pull. But still up front, Ancient Hill having a little bit of a pull now, gone off a little bit mad as they go over the fourth. Successfully negotiated by everybody. So it's Ancient Hill, and the Irish King and Van starters against the fence. And they're followed through by the four of Albert's Eyes, Heart Moon, Frosty Flame and Fired Earth. So still up front, it's Ancient Hill. Leads by five. Take this right turn here. Fairy House. Does that mean there was a house with fairies in it? Is that why it's been called Fairy House? If we've got any Irish connections, maybe they could let us know. Or I could Google it, which is probably the same. But it's still Ancient Hill that leads. But his lead's being cut back now by Heart Moon the Great from Leon. Not going to let Ancient Hill bowl along too much. They're going to the fifth. They'll only have another four flights to negotiate. And just under a mile left to travel. Ancient Hill, happily in the front, by a couple of lengths to Heart Moon. We've got Albert's eyes wide. Inside of that is Frosty Flame. The one against the fence now is the Irish King. And they're being followed through by Fired Earth and Van Starters. So they approach the six. Ancient Hill's going to rise first. Jockey has a quick look round, sees where everybody. Bit of a slow jump by the leader. The other ones that jumped that particularly well were Frosty Flame and the Irish King. The grey against the fence is Heart Moon. Van Starters at the rear just being hurried along a little bit. Keep up with the pace, as is Albert's eyes now. But it's still Ancient Hill. Leads by three to Heart Moon, the Irish King in three. Under a little bit of pressure now, and being pushed along to make a challenge. We've only got four and a half furlongs left to run and a couple to jump. Here comes the Irish King to challenge Ancient Hill. Pulls up alongside. They both jump it together, but Ancient Hill was faster. Gives himself a two-length advantage. Out of the pack comes Frosty Flame. And the fired earth from nowhere against the fence. It's Ancient Hill that still leads us inside the three furlongs now. Ancient Hill from fired earth, the Irish King. They're all under pressure now. Frosty Flame on the outside. Albert Eyes, Van Starters and Heart Moon's gone backwards. But it's still Ancient Hill that leads us to the two furlong pole. It's Ancient Hill by a couple of lengths to fired earth. They get over the eighth, the penultimate. They're all safely over it. And it's still Ancient Hill. Furlong and a half left to run. And the outside here comes fired earth and the Irish King. They're going to make the challenge. Further wider is Frosty Flame but Ancient Hill's under pressure now from the Fired Earth. Fired Earth just noses in front and the last takes it better. Slow jump by, by Ancient Hill's lost the race for him. It's Fired Earth that's going to take this comfortably from the Irish King and Frosty Flame in second and third. Bad jump, poor jump at the last by Ancient Hill. Cost him the race. So Fired Earth for David Thompson, well done. Second was the Irish King for Joshua Sutherland. Third was Frosty Flame for Thunderspark. Fourth was Albert's Eyes for Moilet Surfer. And Ancient Hill, the long-time leader, Jim Murray, uh, ended up being fifth. Now followed through by Van Stars for Del Hinton and Heart Moon for Leon Van Rensburg. OK, let's move on to race 22.